Hello guys and welcome to the first ever ETW Network Web Show. Here on the well, YouTube. Welcome our next I'm your host. Alright, what is this? Well what is it you ask? This asking, this is a show that talks about basically what's going on in the day we well TNA anything else in the world of webcam store nothing much whatever I feel about <laughs> Our first major topic of the first ever ECW Network show is Asperger's Syndrome. Now, I have been diagnosed with Asperger's Syndrome a couple of years ago. And let me tell you, for anyone who doesn't really know about it, this is a mental disorder, like social disorder, disability, that is, that is, is really new. It's a form of autism, and it's big enough, it's difficult to live through. In fact, to player Ian from Big Brother, in my opinion, I'm not sure if it's true or not, but I believe Ian has Asperger's Syndrome. It affects social skills, and it can be pretty bad. It can start, it can, be, it can cause me an anger problem. It's not a good thing to have. I think, well, anyone who understands what I'm going through, this is not a good thing. It's terrible, but we all gotta live through it. It affects me a lot. I hate having to blow up. It's not something I that I want to see happen in my life. This is a terrible thing. That's just, it's just stupid. I hate Asperger, period. And now it's time to talk about the WWE. Raw has been very good since AJ Lee been general manager. So far, chaos is going on. And I'm trying to hate CM Punk for his attitude and what he's been doing as of late. He claimed that he, just because he's the WWE champion, that he must have respect. That he must be given to it like a flatter. Give him respect. Like like this. It's like it's not good. I've had enough with CM Punk and the most difficult thing he did was kicking Jerry Lawler in the back of the head. What was he thinking? Main trying to make John Cena giving the opportunity to become a WWE championship WWE champion. Only if he said that CM Punk was hot with the best in the world. You bet John Cena to say that? No. I'm pro Cena. Again, in my opinion, I'm pro Cena all the way. CM Punk just needs to stop being such an idiot. Now, let's go to the SmackDown. In a SmackDown, Booker T, according to law, in WWE SmackDown, and so far, a lot of chaos is going on, similarly between Sheamus and the world and and Alberto Del Rio. The controversy of SummerSlam, Alberto Rio believes he deserves another shot at the World Heavy Championship. However, he had to beat Randy Orton to get it, and unfortunately, he did. Alberto Rio is now number one contender for the World Heavy Championship. At Night's Champion. What an idiot that Alberto Rio is, and I hope Sheamus can once again beat Alberto the Rio. And now, TNA. What is up with the group? The Aces and Aces. Aces and Aces. They are so out of control. They all remind me of Nactus, but they're gonna kind of little work because they're more than seven. It's even be an animal amount. Who are these people, and how can we stop them? Plus, AJ Nemeal, AJ Styles had a problem of his own situation between him and the World Tag Team, he World Tag Team Champion, the Chris Daniels and Kazarian. 
continued his evening personal. He took the paternity test. He took the paternity test. Never find now by the attorney for for Clara. Clara that it was all a scam. It was all blackmail that was caused by the one Daniel Daniel and Kazarian. And that he apolog she apologizes for everything. This was all scam. A blackmail. By my opinion, the true idiot. The fair do their idiot. Darian and Christopher Daniel. I hope they get their just desserts. It all come down and all of a sudden of course ordinary looking for opponent. Finding out who goes into the number one contender for the teenage world heavy champion at Bound for Glory. And of course, it all happened and continues later on in the in the story. Goes on coming up this Thursday on TNA Impact Wrestling. Well, now my final thoughts before we end it today. My final thoughts are basically this: with all the things going on in either the WWE or TNA. At least the good thing is, at least for one in our life, we haven't got good general managers that are willing to make the good decision to help make the WWE or TNA even better. And with everything going on, I hope you all enjoyed it. And remember that if you want, if you don't learn anything today, the one is there nothing here that I taught you. The one thing you need to know is this. People with Asperger's Syndrome do may sound different, they may sound weird, look or sound weird, but we're just like you. We're human beings. Treat us with, with respect as if though you want respect. That's all I can say. So just enjoy yourself. Have a great day and or night, depending on what you're going to. And we'll hopefully see you next week. Thanks for watching. Good night. Or goodbye. Whatever.